what's up channel? My name is Matthew Ramos and on this channel I am to entertain, inform, and inspire using the topic of discussion as always, which is superheroes! Guys, oh my, I cannot believe I'm making this video. I, I, I actually cannot believe I'm making this video. But um, yeah, Sony confirmed that Andrew Garfield and Tommy Maguire are coming back. And there's so much evidence. This is coming from direct, this is coming directly from Sony. Right before I get into breaking down today's video, guys, make sure to hit that bell notification on my channel to get notified when these videos go up, because I'm sure you would want to get notified for news just like this. And man, I brought I reported this yesterday over on my Twitter, The Real Soups. If you aren't following me on Twitter, make sure to go check me out over there. But I reported this yesterday on Twitter because on Sony's Latin America YouTube channel, they decided to upload a video that it was talking about the three different Spider-Man. And the premise of the video, it, it, it is in Spanish, but again, me being Hispanic and me knowing Spanish, I watched the video and it was talking about the three different Spider-Man and it was basically asking the fans and the viewers watching the video, who is your favorite Spider-Man? So then it proceeds to ask the fans, who is your favorite Spider-Man? But then it says, you don't have to choose. In the Marvel multiverse, anything can happen. And in Spider-Man 3, you will quite possibly see the three Spider-Men, yes, the three Spider-Men, saving the world together. I swear I'm not lying. I swear, I swear to God I'm not lying. This is coming directly from a video that Sony's Latin America YouTube video, YouTube channel posted. All I know, guys, is that someone is getting fired right now. Someone is probably getting tortured right now. But... So this is coming directly from Sony's Latin America YouTube channel and again, this was all translated and this is legit coming from Sony, the people who own Spider-Man and are making Spider-Man 3. So this is coming from a legit source. This isn't rumors, this isn't theories, this isn't speculation, this is legit right here. And since then, the video has been privated so like that no one else can watch it. If this wasn't, if this wasn't legit, why would it be privated? Because it is legit. And, you know, we got confirmation a while back from Sony executives that we are getting our first look at Spider-Man 3 in December. And with all of these rumors circulating around that Tobey Maguire is going to be in this movie, that Andrew Garfield is going to be in this movie, they're going to make that announcement soon. And I think, in my opinion, you know, after Sony dropped this video, I think within the next couple days, I'm giving it, the timetable I'm giving it is December 4th, which is today, all the way to the, through the 9th. This weekend is CCXP, I believe. And if we really look at the way Sony markets Spider-Man films, the first trailer for Spider-Man Homecoming dropped December 8th, 2016. You wanna, you wanna take a guess when Sony released the first trailer for Spider-Man Far From Home? December 8th, 2018. And now, I think December 8th is the day I think they're going to continue the trend. And that day will be the day that they give us our first look at Spider-Man 3. And again, the movie's still a year away, so I don't think we're getting a lot. But we are getting the official confirmation that Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield are going to be in this movie. So much has already been revealed. Jamie Foxx's Electro is going to be in this movie. Doctor Strange is going to be in this movie. We know that the multiverse is going to play a role in this movie. And I'm telling you right now, Sony and Marvel aren't going to let the, the, the news that the three different Spider-Man are assembling in Spider-Man 3, they're not going to get, let that news get leaked by set pictures when Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire are on set with Tom Holland. They're not going to let that happen. They're going to make that announcement soon and it's going to be, it's going to be something that the entire world is talking about. And I couldn't be more excited just because of the, you know, I'm so excited for so many different reasons, but one of the main reasons is, man, guys, us as superhero fans have been deprived of content this year. You know, we've been on such a roll for the past decade with superhero movies coming out every couple months, but 2020, our movies didn't come out. It all got pushed back. Our industry is dying. And it feels like Marvel and Sony are about to reignite the, the fire that lies in every single one of their fans. They're about to reignite the entire industry with this announcement because I don't know a single soul on this planet that wouldn't show up to a theater ready to watch Spider-Man 3 come December 2021 with Andrew Garfield, Tobey Maguire, and Tom Holland! And this is a movie that me and you think about and talk about on a daily basis. And soon enough, the entire world will be talking about this. The entire world will be talking about this movie. It'll be trending on Twitter. It'll be all over Instagram. It'll be all over YouTube, TikTok. It'll be all over everything. Because 
you, when you bring together the three different Spider-Man, you're bringing together Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man, which is the Spider-Man of our childhood, or for me personally. You're bringing together, bringing back Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man, which for me is my personal favorite Spider-Man, in my opinion, the greatest. And he was the Spider-Man of my teens. And then you're also bringing in the MCU Spider-Man that's interacted with all of the Avengers and is played by Tom Holland, who's a fantastic actor. And I, I'm such a huge fan of Tom Holland. So to see him come together with Toby, Andrew, it's going to be, I think it's going, it's going to be the biggest thing that's ever happened in superhero movies besides Avengers Endgame. I think this is something that could rival something like Avengers Endgame because Spider-Man is the most, it's, it's, he's the fans superhero. He's the most popular superhero in the world. And the fact that you're bringing together three different generations and they're all beloved is just so insane to me. It's so real because we've been talking about this, wishing for this, praying for this for how long? And now it's about to be concrete. Now, Sony is about to drop a video with Tom Holland walking out saying, you know what guys, right here, we're here in Atlanta filming Spider-Man 3, but I'm not gonna be alone in this one. And then from his left, from his right, come Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield. Now that I think it's time to talk about this first look, because again, like I said, this movie is still a year away and I don't think we're getting a lot from this first look. But I think again, the, the main thing is going to be just proclaiming to the world that Andrew and Toby are going to be in this movie. So I think, I think it's just gonna be like a promo video of Tom walking out and then bringing them in. And then after that, we can get like a little 30 second snippet of different shots, like a little scissor reel of the movie and them going behind the scenes and filming this movie. But um, yeah, I don't think we're gonna get a lot of footage from the movie. We're definitely gonna get the title. We're definitely gonna get, you know, some, some form of footage of the movie because they have been filming it for quite some time now. And again, the big thing is bringing together Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire to just have the three of them just standing there together so like that we can all just appreciate that shot and the entire world can be buzzing about that. But right now I'm in a headspace where it's just, we're all waiting for them to drop it. We know they're in the movie. We know it, it, it's happening. It's just a matter of seeing, seeing them announce it, seeing them proclaim it. It's not like they're gonna drop this announcement and we're all gonna be like shocked as if we didn't know that Toby and Andrew aren't in this movie. We know they're coming back. It's time for them to announce it. And for me, I think right now I'm just in the headspace that I was back in 2016 or back in 2015 when Captain America Civil War was being promoted. And it, I still remember this day like it was yesterday, guys. It was the day before Marvel dropped the trailer for Captain America Civil War, the, tr the second trailer. And um, th it, this was the trailer that we first got, where we first got to see Spider-Man. And the day before this trailer dropped, I, I was just expressing to my, my friend, like, nothing's ever gonna be the same after this trailer. We are a day away from seeing Spider-Man in the Marvel Cinematic Universe interacting with the other superheroes. And right now I'm in that same headspace in this very moment. Right now, we are a couple of days away. They could drop it right now. They could drop it whenever. But in my and I think that they're going to drop it this somewhere around December eighth, and um, closer to CCXP. So I think again, especially with Sony Sony's Latin American YouTube tra YouTube channel dropping that video, I think in the coming days we will get this announcement, and we are a couple of days away from the announcement that's going to change everything moving forward. This thing, this announcement is going to change everything moving forward. It's going to change more things than, you know, seeing Tom Holland's Spider-Man in the trailer for Captain America Civil War. It's going to change it all. And I'm just, I'm so excited to see just like the amount of love and passion and celebration and joy that we're all going to see and feel across the entire world when something like this happens because we can't experience this in person because they would they would traditionally announce something like this at like a comic con or something like that but because we're not in that safe space as of right now i just i can't wait to feel the rest of the world and to feel the fans just celebrating and expressing their passion and excitement for this upcoming marvel project because spider-man is my favorite marvel hero of all time so I just, I cannot wait to see the world talking about Spider-Man 3. I can't wait to see Toby, Andrew, and Tom all, all together in whatever they release. 
And this is the calm before the storm. Remember this moment, the moment right before they dropped this announcement because life, just everything will never be the same after Sony announces that Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire are coming back to assemble with Tom Holland's Spider-Man. So guys, make sure to follow me on Twitter right now, The Real Soups. Hit that bell notification. Follow me on Instagram and turn on post notifications. And follow me over here on YouTube. Subscribe if you aren't already subscribed. And hit that bell notification on my channel to get notified when things like this go up. Because I will be, I will be on the ball with the content. When everything drops, I'm dropping content. So make sure, excuse me, make sure to stay tuned. Make sure to hit that bell notification. Turn on those post notifications. And with that being said, let me know in the comment section down below how excited are you guys for this announcement, our first look at Spider-Man 3. That's going to change everything moving forward. With that being said, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time!